This slide shows the flapper nozzle system. Here we can see the diagram of simple flapper nozzle system. Here we have supply pressure, typically 20 PSIG. This is the restriction and we have nozzle here. Above the nozzle, there is a flapper. The flapper is attached to a pivot, which means the flapper can move up and down. Thus, open and close the nozzle. And here we have the signal pressure. So the nozzle and flapper mechanism is a displacement type detector, which converts mechanical movement into pressure signals. It is achieved by covering the opening of a nozzle, a flat plate called flapper. This restricts airflow through the nozzle and generate a pressure signal. A regulated supply of pressure, usually 20 PSIG, provides a source of air through the restriction here. The nozzle is open at the end where the gap exists between the nozzle and flapper. Here is the gap. So air can escape in this region within the gap. So if the flapper move downwards in this direction, it close the nozzle so that no air exits and the signal pressure will rise up to the supply pressure which is 20 psi meaning that the signal pressure here will equivalent to the supply pressure but if the flapper move away from the gap the signal pressure will drop because of the leaking of the air. 